I consider myself uh, a, a barbecue perfectionist. I, 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 I kid, I, you know, I have a lot of friends that'll ask me, you know, will you go eat at this place or this place? I've kind of turned myself into a barbecue snob because I know what good barbecue is and, you know, and it's not there. Barbecue has a very unique flavor and it's something that we enjoy doing together as a family. You know, I always wanted to grill, I always wanted to barbecue, I always wanted to do stuff like that. Um, and then with my job that I had as being a police officer, uh, I worked graveyards for, you know, six, seven years. Most of the times, you know, I couldn't sleep and so I'd find myself up at night. Um, so I would start barbecuing and I, and I would cook stuff and, and it got to the point where I, you know, I felt it was pretty good. We have a second family and it's a barbecue family. <laughs> so yes. And like Charles said, the only time we don't get together or the only time we won't talk to you is at turn-in. Any other time, we're very friendly, it's very outgoing, and we love to share recipes, we love to share food, we love to share... People that have good food is the big thing. You know, it's like our logo, because eating bad barbecue is criminal. That's my feeling. I, I feel that it is. If you're eating something that, you know, is a burnt offering that Dad did on the grill, you know, if I can teach you how to do it better, then uh, the more power to you, you know. And, and you know, I've had people come to my class and give me suggestions, and actually help me do something better than what I was doing it before. Um, going to competitions, we love serving to people. We love doing classes. We love watching people go, "Wow, this is really good!" And know that you know the four or six or twelve hours that it took to make it is worth it because people love it. There's not a flavor you can get anywhere else. Because if you don't know how flavors meld together, if you don't know um, when the, like for barbecue, if you don't have the right flavors meld together, it's not gonna be good. You can have the whole process right, but the flavors aren't gonna meld. So there's two things. There's a cooking process as well as the flavor profile. So we work on the uh, flavor profile. I, I totally agree with that. Um, the thing is, I, I joke with my friends that my kids are the only kids that I know that get excited about going and camping in a parking lot. Okay, because that's what we do. A lot of our contests are in a parking lot with canopies and smokers set up. My kids will go out there in a heartbeat and sleep in the back of the truck just to look up at the stars. Those are the things that they're going to remember. That's what makes this so great. Okay, you know what? I, I can go and cook and, and have a lousy cook, but I can't replace the memories that my kids will have forever.